Okay, we're here with the truth. Paul Pierce. Pierce is here for a Spalding photo shoot. Tell me a little bit about what's going on here today in Waltham. We're just days away from training camp. Yeah, just uh, the guys been in here working out today. What I got going on is a print ad I'm doing for Spalding. For people who know, I've been working with Spalding for the last five, six years. So we're just putting together some things last minute before the season start. Now, how's your off season? Obviously, not a lot of time with the the finals run. Uh, and two finals runs over the last three years. You haven't had a lot of downtime in the last couple of seasons. No, not really a lot of downtown, uh, down, downtime this summer. Uh, but I had a chance to get the work in. I got married this summer. Uh, you know, my, my daughter turned two. She's going to school now. So, you know, not really a lot of downtime. And it just seems like right after the finals, we're right back here getting ready for another season. Now, talk about training camp. You guys are going back to Newport. You talked about wanting to go away. You're not maybe going as far away as you wanted, yeah. but you're going to get away from Waltham and get the training camp in. Well, with the amount of new guys we got, I think it's going to be good because, uh, you know, you get away, you get a chance to bond with each other, you get a chance to know your new teammates, and uh, that's going to be good. That helps with when you're trying to develop chemistry in the long run and, you know, you're going to be around guys for nine, ten months. Uh, it's always good to get that early. And so, you know, I'm happy. Talk about what you expect out of some of the new guys. You got guys like Von Wafer coming in, Shaquille O'Neal. I mean, a lot of new faces. Yeah, it's a lot of new faces, but you know, over the last week and a half, a lot of the, everybody, pretty much I've seen everybody's face, uh, either worked out with them or played with them, and you could just kind of feel the energy around here again, man. Like, seriously, we was talking about it today, just the energy, the vibe around here, uh, just about winning another championship. We felt like, you know, we left something behind last year. So, you know, the energy is there, the guys are psyched up, and we're ready to go. So, uh, it's going to be an exciting year. Now, let's talk about what's going on tomorrow, the truth on health. Truth on Health, this is going to be a big rally that I'm having. I had it last year. I uh, got a lot of great events going on so kids can come out and, and have a full, fun day of activities. Uh, I'm going to teach them about health and, and living a, a healthy, active lifestyle. So, uh, you know, I'm just trying to encourage kids to, to eat right and, and be fit. And tomorrow the event is going to be uh, for, for kids of all ages just to come out and, and just have some fun, give them some tips on, on being healthy and being fit. And uh, hopefully they can join my program. They can find out more about it on my, my website, paulpierce.net. Uh, but tomorrow's going to be a lot of fun. This is something you've been into for a long time now. The last couple of years you've really been promoting this in the offseason. Why is this such a personal mission for you? Because it's something that, I, that I've changed in my life. And then uh, when you look around and you see the kids and uh, the growing number of childhood obesity around America, it just, I feel like I have a voice and, and you know, a cause for it. And, and that's something that I, that I personally want to do. And, you know, when I change my lifestyle up on, on how I live and how I eat, uh, and I, I feel like I can help kids around the world do the same thing. Great. Well, we'll see you uh, next week, Media Day on Monday. Newport's all starting all over again. All right, Stringer. I look forward to seeing you there, baby. Sounds good. Thanks a lot, Paul.